Hey, they're just trying to do their job. Cheers. <laughs> I am Sheila B. Wright. And I'm partially deaf. And welcome to <laughs> Don't Drag Us! Cheers! Cheers, baby! How do we do this again? Cheers, big ears! We're body shaming on this channel. <laughs> What's up? What are we doing today? Today, I was thinking that we could probably do some makeup. I love that idea. Wild. We've never done that before. <laughs> crazy. Um, but I was thinking of doing like a theme. Mm -hmm. What kind of theme are you thinking? Wow, well, Sheila, it's actually... Yeah. Australian iconography. <laughs> like the emu. Vegemite. Platypus. This is animals. <laughs> Shapes. So should we get started, Sheila? <laughs> we looked at a lot of like Australian like iconic things. And we were like Vegemite, the beach, the beach, like all of these things. And you know that the, one Australian that thing, one the Austra beach. Bondi Beach. That's the only beach we have. <laughs> we only have one. The colors red and yellow because that's the color of life saving flags and stuff. Mm -hmm. Um, kept popping up. So we're gonna do a red and yellow look. The big lobster and the big banana. Yes, that's true. I've Guys. sucked one of those things. It was a God. lobster. I'm so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> but you may recognize this look that we are going to do These today. Look? These looks. These looks. <laughs> you may recognize the look. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so are you ready to get started? All right. <laughs> Let's talk about it. Okay, so we're doing like an Australia theme. So like. Yeah. What was your experience like growing up in Australia? A part of me doesn't know how to answer that question because I didn't grow up anywhere else, so I can't compare it to anything. How was your experience? Um, did like Auskick as a kid. If you don't know what Auskick is, all of you Americans and stuff, um, Auskick is basically like AFL, but for like babies. Yeah, it's grooming children to like sports. It's literally just getting kids into sport and like getting them active and stuff. Grooming. Backyard cricket. I love backyard cricket. I feel like Australia has a very sports heavy culture. Oh, for sure. Very physical outdoor activity. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I've never related to that experience. I it's feel like I'm missing different. something. Um, is it beauty, glamour? Is it glamour? I think it's talent. Oh yeah. Charisma, uniqueness, nerve and talent. I've got charisma. I've got uniqueness. I have the nerve. She had the nerve to show up. I'm just cun. <laughs> Cunny! Cunny! Hey, Cunny! One of the biggest things I've noticed in like differences between like Australia and like New Zealand, because they're often compared. Yeah, like this. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> the way the indigenous culture, like Maori culture mm. in New Zealand is so embraced and is part of like everyday life. Yeah. And in Australia, it's just not the case. In Australia, yeah. Like we, we don't we don't treat our in, like indigenous Australians the way that the Māori people are like represented and I think it's really sad. Yeah, we have the oldest nation in the world. We do. We have the the oldest culture in the world. So old, it's older than you. Poor I'm pretty old. <laughs> pretty old. <laughs> Look at these wrinkles. So when are we getting injections done? As soon as drag starts paying me back. <laughs> I want to get um I want to get like a uh, we talked about this before. I want to get a mill put yep. into my top lip. So I can have those old stars. So it's like this. <laughs> Hi! Hello! And welcome to Don't Drag Us. Drag Race Down Under. The world got to see what Australian drag is like. Because it's yes. very, very different to like American or British drag. I feel like where America had Rocky Horror Picture Show, Australia had Priscilla, Priscilla. Queen of the Desert. Yeah. Yes. Oh, we had Dame Edna. I remember when I was young, I yeah. had a Dame Edna tape of reading some kid's book. Yeah. And it was like, I got that for Christmas from like my mum. And that was just like a normal thing to give a kid was a drag cream, queen, cr a drag cream. Drag cream. Buy oh. now a drag cream. It'll make you look good. <laughs> to give a child like a drag queen reading a children's book. Yeah. And that was just like a completely like normal thing to drag do. Drag queen story hour. I'm kind of happy that we're doing the, the red and yellow look like the lifeguard sort of situation. Yeah, we grew up around the beach. We did. We, we My dad was like beach. a surfer surfer. So he went like three times a week. Yeah. And he would just take all the kids with him because they had to get out of the house. What sort of TV shows did you grow up that were Australian? Round right? the twist. Oh, Round yeah. the twist is iconic. I will say some of that shit. Mm -hmm. 
terrifying. I remember the Scarecrow episode was one that was terrifying. Yeah. I'm up to my nose contour. I love that for you. Girl, let's go. You know what? Let's kick it. I need to celebrate. Celebrate. With some Mount Gay rum. <laughs> Brandy, <laughs> bro, you. My Mount Gay. My Mount Sponsor us. We're gay. Stop stealing yes. from our society. You shall not borrow from my community without paying it back. Okay, highlight time! Highlight. We're gonna make these highlight, money moves. Highlight, highlight. I wanna look like I just walked out of a bukkake session. Let's go! Hey, they're just trying to do their job. Cheers. <laughs> Show I remember what the saddle club. The saddle club. Hello world, this is me. Well, cause like I feel like growing growing up in yeah. primary school, all the girls had saddle club. Yeah, and all the boys had like poker gun. Poker gun. Poker gun. If you poke her, she's gone. She's gone. <laughs> Honestly, what powder? I'm going to leave everything messy today. I am not defending <gasps> anything. Who are you and what have you done with I Porsche? Know. All right, so we have powdered and we are going to start doing our eyes now. I've already made this color way too strong. Hi. I, I literally was meant to like brush it on lightly and I'm like, you want color? You get a color. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing with my face. Hey, this is generally how our looks work. Oh. Uh, interesting. Show me. Ready? <laughs> How far are you? I'm actually, um, I think I've finished my eyes. I think I just need to add this really nice inner white line that I'm kind of playing with. And uh, liner and lash, and then I think my eyes are pretty much done. I love that. I think I'm close to them. What is your like favorite Australian food? Tim Tams? Tim Tams! Tim Tams? I've always said Tim Tams. Fairy bread. Fairy bread. Fucking fairy, fairy bread. bread. Do you reckon? There'll be some iconic Australian food in this house right here for us now. There possibly could be. Give me one second, I'll be right back. <laughs> that was one second. Look what I prepared oh, earlier! Wow. Oh. Ah. Wait, oh okay. <laughs> no, I'm not waiting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so hungry. Fairy bread is literally, all it is is bread, butter, and like hundreds and thousands of like sprinkles. Oh. And it's like this Australian treat that is at every kid's party. Mm. It's iconic, always will be. Mm. And it's just so good, even though it's literally just little bits of sugar and butter on bread. I could cry. <laughs> I don't feel good. <laughs> Honestly, I'm kind of sad that I didn't take that considering I have acid reflux. So I oh could be good. Be good. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Once we put eyeliner and lashes on, that's normally when we're like, now we're in the gig. It's now it's getting thing. done. Yeah. Now we have done the thing. But yeah. I'm actually pretty proud of what I've done with this. And I think I turned up. <laughs> Ooh. Mm. Oh. No. Fact, 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 fact. False lashes were used by hookers in the old days to stop cum from getting in their eye. That is the origin of a fake lash. Why are you telling them my secret? <laughs> <laughs> oh, if it is. Oh. 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 Done. done. All right, look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Love it. Oh, you do? I love it. Do you actually? Love the zinc spots. Yeah. I love the sunrise. Like, like a sunrise or a Honda. Very gorgeous. Yeah. With the brown leaf, it yes. works. I love this yellow kind of ombre going on from the inside right to the outside. Oh, look at those eyes with a really nice and pretty tall eye, oh, don't they? And you've got a nice zinc lip going on. Oh my gosh, she's pretty. she got all this little contour. <laughs> 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 oh, anyway. Great. Should we take a little, 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 little. Little tiny little selfie. I think we take the smallest selfie that's ever happened. Maybe.
done. Hello, we are. We're finished. Oh, this finished. is our final look. Anyways, look at me. 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 I'm blue. Stunning. Absolutely stunning. Stunning. Giving zinc. Thanks. Giving beach realness. Yeah. She may not be yes. a beach person, but she went to the beach and yeah. she looks fabulous doing it. Yes, in a button shirt with all of my jewelry ready oh. to go because I'm not swimming. Well, I have no idea what you're about to do. You're about to have a tent orgy. <laughs> you're about to go into the I'm water. I'm not going to lie, I'm out. literally giving you like. Surf Bogan that went to Bali. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That That's is, that is the MO here. Honestly, but this is but a vibe. But I haven't. This is a whole vibe. This is a vibe. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much. Thank you for coming. This is the start of season two. Mm hmm We've made it this far. Mm hmm Like, compare this to the start of season one, and I think we've, <laughs> we've actually, we've made some remarkable- Must we compare? We've made <laughs> some remarkable changes in our makeup. We've yes. come so far. I think that needs to be acknowledged. Mm hmm And also, we're stunning. So, um, love ya. Mwah.